What do we have today? A Wemius P64 projector. Doesn't that look nice? Comes in a nice box with the amazing design on the front. Let's see what we've got here. We've got your questions and answers. Leaflet. So it's helped if you have any questions, they've answered it for you on this paper. Enjoy every moment. Now look at this guys. Dear customers, a nice little message there for you. It's your warranty card, so if you scan this, it take, takes you to the uh, Weemus warranty. You can sign up for an extra two years warranty, which is fantastic. Well protected in the box. Wow, let's get this out. It's actually not that heavy. So all your accessories are at the bottom of the box. As you can see, all neatly laid out in the bottom of the box. So this is your AV cable. Very good. This is that HDMI lead with plastic end caps to keep them safe, which is good. That's your power cable. Decent length as well. You get a cleaning cloth to clean the lens. And you get some swabs to clean the dust. And the remote. It's a little different compared to the P62 projector. Slightly different remote. And we have the manual, user manual. There's quite a lot in this manual. There's multiple languages, as you can see. Well written, very good detailed manual. Tells you everything, how to set it up, what settings, and the box is empty. So let's have a look at this projector. It looks great on the box and by the website. Let's see what it looks like in the flesh. Oh wow. Oh look at that. That is nice. Oh I really like that design. That is nice. That is really, really nice. It looks a little bit like a K1 on the front. Oh yeah, look at that, that's your heat sink. It's a very nice design. Wow, look on the back. Ah, so here we go, this is all the connections. Oh, the styling on this is great. This is really nice. There's your USB ports, two, your two HDMI's, your AV input, and then we've got your headphone jack. This is your power socket, and these are your speakers on the back. Very nicely laid out. You've got touch sensitive buttons on the top. This is your power button, up and down, left to right, OK button, your back button, and your focus in and out. 
very different this year with the um, touch touch controls on the side here we've got a filter oh, I just love the design that's your heat sink nice big heat sink in there so that'd be great for temperatures and keeping the product cool and this is your door to clean clean the dust so you open this door, put your lens swab in, clean the dust, and then pop it back. It's that easy. But I just love this design, Wemius. Brushed aluminium look. So this is your lens cap. Remove your lens cap before focusing in and out. We have touch sensitive buttons on the top here or we can focus it by the remote and the lens will focus in and out I just really love this brushed aluminum look it's such a nice looking projector it's really well made very well constructed and put together it feels solid in the hands the build quality is excellent boy means you've done a great job on the styling this is your remote so this is your power button that's your mute button this is your home button, your settings button. These are your directional arrows and your OK button. That's your menu button, your play pause function, your back button, your volume adjustment, and your focus adjustment. And that's your source button to change sources. These are your focus buttons to so you can focus the lens in and out. And you take the back off and it takes two AAA batteries. They don't provide the batteries but I mean they're cheap enough. Just pops on. I really like this styling. Such a nice projector. I mean look how much nice that looks. That brushed aluminum look. Such a nice, good looking projector. This is your autofocus camera, so it can focus up and down, in and out, does it automatically. This is the camera that reads that. That's your heat sink. And this is where you take the um, filter out. There's a tray underneath that just slides out. This projector gets a massive thumbs up from me. Superb build quality, excellent design fantastically constructed it's a little taller but shorter in width and depth i think we must have to be commended here to the design and engineering that's gone into making this product it's a beautiful design these four rubber feet are mounting holes you remove these four feet to mount it to the ceiling or on a stand Underneath the projector we have two feet. We have a smaller foot and a larger foot behind it. So this is the smaller foot and there's a larger foot behind it. So I'll just show you the little foot up close now. As you can see this is the smaller foot. Leave the smaller foot out first before removing the second one. It just makes removing the second one a little easier. This is the second foot. As you can see, it creates a lot of height, projecting the image higher on the wall. The feet close nicely into the body of the projector. This is the filter. You slide the tray out, clean the dust and slide it back. So let's show you this amazing design once again. Let's show you around the projector. Look how nice that looks. Such an amazing design. Very nicely put together. Nicely laid out. Great styling. Queen has done an absolute fantastic job. And it gets a massive thumbs up from me. Now let's test the projector and see what it's capable of. Booting up the projector is very fast 
and you will get to the operating system in around 20 seconds, which is a fantastic speed for our projector. Now we're at the user interface of the projector and as you can see the image is very sharp, very bright and colourful. It's an excellent picture. When you're on the user interface you can change the various projection settings within its menu. So if you go up to the cog, this is your settings. If you scroll down to projection image settings, you can change it to front desktop, rear desktop, front ceiling or rear ceiling. Now if you're mounting the projector on the ceiling you would need to go into these settings and change it accordingly so you get the correct picture displayed on your wall. Then we have four point keystone. Keystone correction is a projector feature that allows you to point the lens towards the wall at an angle and adjust the image so that it is displayed in a 16 by 9 aspect ratio. The four point keystone correction feature helps you overcome angles from room limitations. Keystone correction is a great tool for correcting large picture imbalances so if your walls are not perfectly straight you can straighten the image using the keystone setting. Then we have a zoom setting. If you select this it will allow you to increase or decrease the size of the projected image without moving the projector. And with the zoom setting we can make fine adjustments for the exact fit. Just like that. Perfect. Then we have omnidirectional automatic correction autofocus and power on autofocus. Now if you have these turned on, when you power on the projector, it will autofocus and auto keystone all on its own, saving you the trouble. Simplicity at its best. And then we have the Wi-Fi section. The Wemius P64 uses Wi-Fi 6 technology and as you can see it has fantastic range picking up all these wireless networks. Then we have other settings. This is where you can change your language or turn the key tones off so you don't get those clicking sounds. Then we have your Bluetooth settings. The Wemius P64 uses Bluetooth 5.2 technology which is two-way and bi-directional Bluetooth meaning I can stream music directly from my phone to the projector because the P64 can act as a Bluetooth speaker. An absolute amazing feature. Now we're going to stream music from my phone to the projector, so I'll show this now. Look for the Wemius P64 in the devices. And once you're paired, you should be able to stream music from your phone to the projector. So this is actually coming from my phone. And I'm streaming it to the projector. So I'm using the projector as a Bluetooth speaker. Then we, we can change tracks. The sound is very good on this projector. I was quite surprised. Uh, we can turn it up using the phone.
just nice to be able to stream from your phone straight to the projector. So yeah, that's how you can use that's how you can use the projector as a Bluetooth speaker, which is a great fun function. I really like that function. So it's nice that they added that to this year's projector. Then we have system local update. This is where you can update the projector software using a USB memory stick. Then we have the about section. This is where you can check the model number of your projector, the software version, the wireless MAC address, do a system upgrade or even a factory reset. Also with the Wemius P64 projector, we have Miracast and AirPlay function. For Android users it's Miracast and for Apple it's AirPlay. We can stream things directly from our phone to the projector. But bearing in mind, these will be normal videos from your phone to the projector. We cannot cast Netflix due to HDTP protocols and copyright protection. But any other video, we could stream directly from our phone to the projector, which is an excellent feature. If you want Netflix capabilities, I highly suggest to get yourself an Amazon Fire Stick or a Google Chromecast. These can be purchased relatively cheaply and you'll be able to watch all your subscription services on the Wemius P64 projector. As you can see, this is my Google Chromecast. I have now turned the P64 into a smart projector. So now we're going to launch YouTube and we're going to look for some 4K footage so you can see how stunning the image quality of this projector really is. Wow, look at the contrast ratio. Magnificent detail. Blacks are black, whites are white. And we have excellent color accuracy Look at the purples in those flowers. The colour accuracy on this projector is excellent. Images almost pop off the display. It is that crystal clear. I can see every single hair on that bee. That is how much detail this projector puts out. The colour accuracy on the ham the lettuce and the tomatoes is spot on. The Wemius P64 projector has excellent sharpness across the whole frame. Look how vibrant those reds are and how highly detailed those rain droplets are. And you've got all your presets here so you can change the colours and everything. So you have pre-programmed settings like I'm changing the brightness as you can see, nice black levels. So you can adjust the brightness, the contrast, the saturation, and the sharpness. So you can tune the image quality to exactly how you want. So I'm turning the contrast up here. 65 is quite a good, good, uh, good area for me. So that's the saturation and you can change the colour temperature but I think the colour accuracy anyway is fantastic so I'm not going to mess around with those settings these are your pre-made settings so this is what Wemius have done that's Vivid that's, this is Sport Movie. Movie looks great. Game. And energy saving. But even with those modes, you can still um, 
change so even if you select energy saving or game or anything like that you can still alter them settings if you wish but I'll just go to normally user and then use the user profile and then you can tune it how you like but you can do it on all the other ones as well if you want and if, if you mess up at any time you can also reset the settings which is good I mean look at those colours absolutely phenomenal really really fantastic the brightness is cr look how crisp it is look at them tomatoes they look so lifelike so real it's a fantastic projector it really is for, for colors and for brightness and sharpness it's great that's the thing with uh, Wemius projectors um, their, their, their sharpness is really really good I mean I've got a lot of projectors and Wemius is the sharpest out of all my projectors and I own four and it's Wemius are normally, normally spot on with their projection the, the sharpness because normally there's some projectors that are just not sharp or they're they're like soft around the edges but not Wemius Wemius is very very sharp very good their, their image always looks in focus whereas others other projectors if you so you doesn't matter how, how much you try and tune them sometimes they just look a little bit soft on the edges and that but not weemius they're edge to edge sharpness which is brilliant and as you can see look how lifelike the colors are I mean, wow, look at those greens on that snake. That's absolutely fantastic. You see every little scale on his skin, so detailed. And there's your whites and your blues. You see every little hair in real life, because every little hair on his on his back. Look at the colour accuracy on the blues. It's very, very good. It looks obviously much better in real life than obviously I'm on my cell phone. I mean, look at those blues. Look at the detail in the water. That's absolutely amazing. They've really, really done a good job with this projector. I mean, look how lifelike they look. And obviously if you're playing a movie this is coming directly from YouTube so obviously you've got compression to worry about as well but if say if you downloaded a video and you put it onto a memory stick and you was playing it straight from the projector you wouldn't be losing any quality so obviously from from a from a USB stick and even if you could attach a hard drive to it I mean you're gonna get even better picture quality and obviously streaming because this is relying on your internet but I mean it still looks absolutely amazing anyway I better wrap this uh, video up because it's nearly half hour long in my opinion this projector is fantastic value for money and Wemius is a really good company to support because their customer service is excellent 
and if you have any problems they always do their best to put things right and they usually reply within 24 hours. I hope you enjoyed this video.